Hi, I'm Muhammad Sami Usman. I'm a research candidate at University of Putra, Malaysia. I'm sending this regarding my publication in my journal, which is Synthesis, Characterization and, and Antimicrobial Properties of Copper Nanoparticles. Uh, the synthesis was carried out by chemical means. It's a very simple and straightforward process which involves synthesis of copper in the medium of hydrogen as polymer, hydrogen reducing agent, ascorbic acid as protective agent. Uh, the method the nanoparticles were obtained by so many methods of characterization, uh, such as UV base, uh, SEM, scanner electron microscope, and so on. Uh, the method produced nanoparticles as low as 2 nanometers. Uh, it's really good. Well, yeah, the nanoparticles are really good. Some antibacterial properties of analysis was conducted. Thank you. of the uh, antimicrobial activity of the uh, L, L inside the copper cytosine nanoparticles uh, using the agar diffusion method according to the uh, clinical uh, laboratory institute uh, standards guidelines. Uh, as you know, uh, resistance to antimicrobial agents has become uh, widespread and is on a steady rise. And, uh, Bacterial and fungal infections are a causative agent of uh, different uh, and uh, problematic uh, infectious diseases. And the nanomedicine and nanotechnology is a promising field uh, utilizing the combination of uh, chemistry and biology uh, for the uh, synthesis and development of uh, new antimicrobial agents. And, uh, by testing uh, the S inside the copper cytosine nanoparticles against uh, different microorganisms of clinical significance, such as uh, MRSA, methicillin resistant Staph aureus, and uh, Pseudomonas aeruginosa, causing uh, different uh, devastating uh, human and animal infections. We found that uh, these compounds, uh, the copper cytosine nanoparticles, uh, are highly active uh, against both gram-positive and gram-negative. In addition, uh, they show uh, antifungal activity. Uh, finally, uh, we can uh, uh, find that uh, these uh, copper cytosine nanoparticles uh, will find uh, suitable applications in the field of uh, biomedical and pharmaceutical applications as uh, newly uh, developed uh, nanoparticles, antimicrobial agents.